Hey y'all, it's Tuesday and I am outside. Just wanted to do a quick walkthrough of what used to be a garden, garden, a garden and what's about to be a garden. All right, one second. That corner, there used to be some garden boxes. They have since been moved after this past weekend. You'll see that video soon. As you can see, we've been blowing leaves and we need to put grass seeds back here because our yard is not grassy. Over here, this is where I will have mint growing um, I have some cabbage, I mean some um, spinach there. I'll have Swiss chard there. That's a flower that I got for Mother's Day last year. It's now starting to come back. I'm going to also plant this um, hyacinth. I'm going to plant it in three different places. A tulip that's coming back up and a cabbage that's growing. That right there is lemon balm. Over here we have more lemon balm. This over here is going to be, I don't even know. So check this out. I bought these seeds, I mean this seed tray from uh five below if you guys remember it's not the best it's, um the seed starter it's okay but i feel like it's not the best uh, product because by now i should have way more things popping up than what you see in here so this was a trial and error um is it trial and error yeah and i can see that it's not doing that well so i will be replanting the seeds of everything that are in here strawberries are here that's lavender and this is like gonna be the herb garden again rosemary did really well throughout the winter it's still coming back that sage right there that's gonna end up coming back um we have here what i thought was gonna be echinacea or coneflower i don't even know if that's what that is but we got another tulip we have some oregano that did not die over the winter which is doing really really well and all this is gonna be herbs this right here, this twig, this big old thing, citronella. It'll come back. It always comes back every year. Garlic is here. And around here, you'll see where I've cleaned out most of the stuff. All of this right here, this entire area is a garden. It was a garden anyway last year. I'll try to pop up videos from what was over here. If not, you'll see when it gets started. But back there, that very corner where that little rod is, I don't know if I can zoom in or not. Yep, that's part of my raspberry bush that looks like it's dead. I don't know. We'll see once, you know, the spring comes in. But this here, that's where my peas were and some cucumbers. This here, more cucumbers will grow here. Y'all excuse the airplane and I had lots of tomatoes growing here. I don't live far from where airplanes reside all right so these are i'm gonna do a lot of container gardening mostly mostly container gardening this year but these are by um some of my pots that i already had from last year and i'm gonna just you know re-up on those these are seedlings that i've planted um i showed you guys all of this on sunday but i moved everything over here um if you look here you can see that i have things growing inside of there um and then i'm going to use this probably for like leafy greens since it has the cover and i can shade it and then these are my two garden boxes i did not treat them so um yeah the wood is kind of not doing well um but i am going to reinforce them i'm also going to let them completely dry out then i'm going to treat them and then i'm going to put some weed barrier in the bottom of it and i'm going to reuse those for planting this year so all in all let me back up a little bit. I do have a large yard, but I try to garden in a small area. So the garden will be from here all the way back there. And then we'll have the, the um, herb garden here. And then we'll have some vegetables and things here. We need to get the house power washed too. Huh. I need to call somebody and get that done. Or you know what? I'll let my husband do that. <laughs> 